Hello everyone, welcome back to Simulated Heaven and welcome back to our Factor 2. I have found a really cool track, a karting track, um, which is in Valencia, in Spain. I'm not going to try to say it, but I'm going to leave a link in the description. I, those of you that watch my channel will know that I love karting. I'm always on the lookout for nice new karting tracks. So I am in R Factor 2, this uh, Valencia karting track, and I'm in the Formula. Is it called the F1 kart? I think it's called. No, I, I'd just like to point out I've not learnt the track very well. I'm really bad at the track. But I've been really impressed. I've been driving around here for like 10 15 minutes. And for a modded track, this track looks pretty amazing. And it flows real nice. It's a little bit tricky. Like this corner, I always forget about that corner. And I seem to be having issues with controlling the car. It seems to slide way too much. I think I'm just trying to go too fast too quickly. Like this corner here is quite tricky. But I'm... I'm having fun. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. See what I mean? The car is going all over the road. But I seem to be getting real solid frame rate. Whoa, 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 whoa. Like, I seem to be getting really solid frame rates. The graphics of the track, I think, are real nice for a modded track. So if you like karting, I'll put a link in the description. I would highly recommend, even though I suck at this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe I just need to get used to the handling of R Factor 2 karts again. I've not really... Been, a, been in them recently. I mean, I don't know which, really if I'm honest, I've never actually driven a proper racing kart before, so I can't really tell you which game has got the most realistic physics karts. I, I would say that at the moment my favourite is probably Auto Mobilista, uh, probably closely followed by Kart Racing Pro. This one is up there. I mean, I don't know. Um, this one feels a little bit too slidey for me. Maybe that's just me, or maybe it's because I don't know how to make a setup. But um, yeah, certainly this track has made me want to have a go in our pack two carts again. And I actually found this track on the race department forum, so. You always have to kind of check in those kind of was a one, zero, you, you always one, have to check one, in those five, kind of places. Four. You will find some rubbish tracks in those places. Whoa, whoa, whoa! See what I mean? I always do that. I'm like sliding out all the time. Oh dear me! Um, yeah, so you do have to check in those kind of places. The race department is usually a good source both for this game, Auto, Mobilista, you know, any of those kind of sim racing games, a set of course or whatever, you can usually find pretty cool mods on the race department forum. And also, people will review them. So usually before I download, I'll look at people's reviews to see what they say, because obviously if people say it's not good, then I'm not going to download it. So that's also a pretty useful thing to have. You know, I think I'm gradually learning this track. <laughs> um, whoa, 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 whoa. I have to say, I don't think I've fully dialed that in was a one, the, zero, the five, force feedback. Point, okay, nine, FFP, four. force feedback. I feel like I've not quite dialed it in properly yet. It doesn't quite feel as good as auto but that might just be because I've not dialed it in. Oh, and I do that quite often as well, damn it. Yeah, it might just be I've not dialed it in myself as well as I should have done. Oh, see, I'm like all over the road. Maybe it's because the track is still quite green as well. Um, I've only been on here for like 10, 15, maybe 20 minutes at the most. Maybe after the practice being longer, we get more rubber down on the track. Maybe that'll make a difference. Because that's obviously one major feature they have in this game, which makes this very, like, a really good feature of this game. The, um, the fact the tracks will rub that in, that's one nine, feature point, they've not been nine, able to get five. into Automobilista. But I do remember hearing them saying, or someone saying that they've got a possibility of making some kind of plug-in 
for their engine or whatever. You know, that in the future they might be able to do that on Automobilista. I mean, that would be amazing because that's the one big feature that's not really in there at the moment. It does make quite a big difference. The feeling that, that you get in a practice of a track bubbling in is quite good. And obviously it feels quite realistic. I have to say, I'm quite impressed with the graphics Ooh, of this track. The mountains in the background seem pretty nice to me. But that just is only to me. Maybe I have no idea what I'm talking about, but yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I see what I mean. I think I'm just trying to go too fast. Like, yeah. This is quite a hard track for me to learn, it seems. And there's lots of hairpin corners, which... At first, I was trying to slide them too much. Oh, rubbish. Right, let's just do a replay, shall we? Like an idiot. Yeah, replay. Me being bad at karting. Let's uh, see if we can rewind that a bit to show you something interesting. So, anyway, after this video ends, I am going to be spending the next uh, while trying to learn this. Trying to improve. Because, uh, like I said at the start, I do enjoy the karting in uh, in simulator games. R Factor 2 has got a pretty good set of karting, and the fact that people are, are releasing these kind of tracks is pretty awesome. Because the one thing I'd say about Auto Mobilista, even Kart Racing Pro, even though they're they've got really good physics on the karts, in my opinion, um, they they don't have a lot of extra tracks. Like, we don't have many tracks for karting, really. Um, so, it kind of helps R Factor 2. Well, R Factor 2 doesn't have that many either. I mean, it'd be nice. I think when the modders are making tracks, karting tracks are not really high up there on the list of the, of the type of tracks they would like to make, if you know what I mean. So, hopefully, in the future, on all all those games we'll see that more people are making these kind of karting tracks because it certainly adds to the fun anyway as i spin off and crash in the replay i will leave it at that i hope you enjoyed the video and as always i will see you in the next one Bye bye